what are some unique aspects of some of your learning and development programs? The first thing is the positive psychology, so that's unique. Uh, we put the person first. If we don't have a student, then the teacher's irrelevant. So my job is to get people excited about learning. And we go back to the why. Why should I learn? Well, we know that it, it will help you prosper. It's job security. You know, it's interesting people think the company they work for is job security. Your competencies are your job security, not the company you work for. And if you're competent and you continue to grow, then your ability to rebound from losing a job or deciding to change jobs, you can find a job quicker. You'd be, you're, you're in more demand. Uh, today, people are looking for competency-based people with good attitudes and a good emotional balance. And so if we could teach people that, then they become a learner because they say, okay, that's the reason why I need to learn this. So we take that approach. We put the person as a person first, and then we try to make it fun to learn. You know, and, eh, we do games and stuff like that, but I'm talking about intellectual fun where we give them an assignment, something simple, and we say, now, we want you to in the next five days do this, and they give us feedback. And then they actually go and apply something. They come back and they say, well, it's really worked. And they create a hopeful outlook because they'll try something new. They get results. And they say, I didn't think I could do that. But now that I did it and I got the results that you said I could get, I think I could do this again. And, and that's important is to really make it simple enough that people could go and apply little things and come back with victories. And little victories add up to confidence that, wow, I could learn new things and try it. So we, we really take a lot of time breaking things down so that people can apply some of this learning. We try not to make it so big that people say, well, I don't even know where to start. We give them a place to start and say, this is the first thing you need to do, the second thing you need to do. Another unique thing we do is um, I try to do multi-session classes. Try not to do one class. I mean, if it's technical training and it's, it's one thing they need to learn, that's different. But when it comes to product and it comes to networking and relationship building or personal development, they're all multi-class learning modules. At least two classes. Personal development is 14 classes. So every employee in our bank spends 14 weeks with me, with a group of 20 people, and we do an actual transformation in some people. You know, they, they come in very timid, uh, never spoke in front of a group, and after 14 weeks, they're out there talking and they, they could stand in front of a group and do a presentation and um, they can be emotional and, and their confidence rises up. And so that's unique. I know a lot of companies are moving away from in-person training and we're doing 14-week training. And I have some people that tell me, wow, that, that's crazy. It's not crazy, it's effective. You know, it's too much time. Well, you either want it to be effective or you want it to be short, but my goal is to be effective. So we invest 14 weeks, but the outcome is we get a different person at the end. And we get the benefit for years after that. So we make a small investment, but then we get that, that benefit manifests itself. And then it's a ripple effect. And so their transformation, their change affects other people that they work with. So it, it's really worth our investment.